Hey guys, how's it going? Sorry for the delay, but I'm here now. How's everybody doing? Thanks for talking amongst yourselves. <laughs> you have a button for Twitch Turbo. I don't even know what that means. What the heck is Twitch Turbo? Yes, Ninja. Come join me, cat. Come here, Dan. Come here. She's not come here, because that's what she do. Oh, magic conch. Will Kenshin escape the island? What are you waiting for? Okay. I guess. Yes. <laughs> Doge, Mr. B. What's up? I think Twitch Turbo allows no ads. Interesting. I don't know. Anywho. Hey, guys. Hope you're all doing well tonight. Let's go get started. Twitch Turbo was before Twitch Prime? Oh, so it shouldn't exist anymore? That's interesting. Oh, it looks like I'm half dead, too. I should, uh, I should go have a little sleepy sleep. There's Ninja. Hi, baby. Uh, no, it should not. Wow, look at all that money I got. Right, because I got, um... Got at least one. A, uh, a year, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, Merle popped up and got me some coins. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <coughs> that Turbo was the villain from that Disney movie. Wasn't Turbo the hero? You gotta be cool. <sighs> no? The villain. Wasn't the movie called Turbo? Was there not a movie called Turbo? Am I completely, absolutely bonkers? Entirely possible. I fully admit. Wreck It Ralph? I swear there was a movie called Turbo! About like one of those superhero dogs? Oh, different movie? Okay. <laughs> I feel a little better now. I wasn't completely cr It was about a snail, that's right. And it's the joke, these snails fast, okay. Okay, I feel better. <laughs> I feel better. The dog was underdog. Ah, bold. Okay, there's a lot of dog movies. <laughs> Either way, I was wrong. I was wrong. Here comes a ninja. She's here. Yeah. Mwah. I loved you, girl. Let's see. So, last week. We got our new Captain Bobbery here. Blobbery? Bobbery? Barbery? Burberry? Burberry coat? There are a lot of dog movies like the Santa Paws, Air Bud, the Shaggy Dog, Air Bud 2, Underdog, followed the Flash style origin story but got super bad powers. <laughs> and Mohawk's here too, what's up? Teddy, what was that Super Sog dog movie we watched all the time as a kid? Uh, Homeward Bound? Old Yeller? <laughs> Old Yeller was a very sad dog movie. Um, Scruffy? Ah, uh, it is Barbary. Welcome back to you. Do you know how worried we were? My stomach has been most upset. It's like the dog equivalent of Forrest Gump. What, he just shows up in random historical events? That's kind of amazing. Scruffy, I've never heard of that. <clears throat> Today I've decided to make your brains hurt with a concept. Oh dear. <laughs> Hook me up. Let's hear it. Uh, no thank you, Talon. <laughs> I must worry for about everyone here, but who worries for Flavio? No one. Do you know how hard that is for me to sit here in safety and worry so much? I do not know what is out there waiting to lurch... Uh, waiting... Waiting to lurch in and snack upon me. I do not even know how to get home for the sake of the bl blue briny sea. I can talk, but no more yelling. That was the time to pull together and work as a team. Flavio, old boy, I must say, uh, arr, I'm losing any accent. Can't handle that today. I'll get the ibuprofen. I'm struggling just to open a package of jerky. Oh no, Teddy. Mmm, jerky sounds good. I didn't have a proper dinner. Arr, Flavio, old boy, I must say, you talk... Rather too much. Such insolence. I growl at you like an angry jungle beast. 
Oh, I ought to. So, in any case, Mario, about that crystal shard ye spoke of earlier. There were a rather odd rock in the far east of the jungle with a skull carved into it. Call it an old sea bomb's intuition, but that skull rock smells suspicious. Hey, 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 Bobbery, you want to know what really smells suspicious? Oh, excuse me, I had beans earlier. Flavio's armpit! Oh, he smells like low tide! Whoar! But seriously, you may be onto something with that there rock. I say that's where the treasure is. Well, anyone could figure that out, you mutinous joker. I mean, how obvious. I was already saying in my head that the treasure was certainly behind that rock. And as such, I will continue the noble duty of protecting this camp from invasion. Uh, Captain Mario, carry on. I am so sorry to make so many requests of you. You're not, but you know. Err, Flavio, you old cash grubber. If you want the treasure, why don't you get it yourself? Oh, well, uh, yes, Admiral, uh, you see. I, uh... Flavio is also not, uh, sorry. Uh, well, yes, you do have a point. Uh, let us decide this fair and square, shall we? Listen to me, everyone who thinks I should go along to investigate the Skull Rock. Oh, heck yes. Yeah, take him a foot off there. Off with you. <laughs> there you have it, Flavio. Oh, there you have it, Flavio. Fair and square, eh, what? Um, no. Not fair. Flavio hates you all. Flavio will join you for a short time. Really? Really? Oh my god. I've got a whole entourage now. I didn't realize it made a little armpit fart noise when he made the joke. Oh, I didn't hear it. It was too quiet. Dang. Oh well. Alright. We're off. You clipped it? Oh good. <laughs> nah, I'd rather not, thanks. Now let's find this skull rock. We'll wait until later to break your brains. Appreciate the talent. Apparently, uh, we can't handle that. Oh, I had beans. Let's see. It was perfect timing. Oh! I'm assuming I don't get Flavio in battle. Which is perfectly fine, because he sucks. Ah. Didn't quite make it. Yo, it's stylish! <laughs> sure, you wasted that item, but alright. I have to relearn the timing of that. Ow! Oh, wait, that didn't kill him? Hang on. I wasn't paying enough attention, apparently. Most unfortunate. <clears throat> Bomb squad. One. Wasn't I doing more than that a minute ago? What am I missing? What did I do wrong? Spoiler, under the island, Mario finds an ancient city and finds an even more powerful magic object. Oh boy, I can't handle another one. The crystal hot dogs! Are they still spicy? Ah, rude! Slightly too late? Oh, that's possible, yeah, I suppose. Stylish! And then eats them. Okay, there we go. That's a huge drop-off, though. Either get it perfect... See, I thought I had. I must have... I just... I've taken a minute to get into the swing of things. Mubby. Hey, 
that you want to see me eat five warheads at once? Oh man, I haven't had a warhead in a million years. Wow. I almost forgot this. I eat warheads for breakfast. Stenzer! Giving you a lyric. Hope that everyone's having a wonderful weekend. Thank you, Stenzer. I hope you're having a good weekend too. I always do the hand gestures like I'm playing. <laughs> While you watch, that's excellent. Oh, Merle. I don't need your help here, dear. Thank you, though. The enriched uranium is quite good. Somehow I had a feeling you were talking about that kind of warhead talent. Call me crazy. There's another kind? Yeah, you know the candy? You never had warhead candies? They were a big deal when I was when I was in um, elementary school. Yeah, they're very sour. Yeah, warheads. They're war or are they no, that's airheads. Never mind. I was like, they're out of control. That was airheads. Yeah, in elementary school and middle school, they were super popular. Oh, I didn't need to do that one. You know, I didn't go through this area enough, so, uh... Oh, you gotta be kidding me! I love how we're... God, I was too far over. I love how Flavio jumped on our back, too. Flavio rides on Mario, right? Sometimes they're sour, sometimes they're sweet. That's Sour Patch Kids. Yeah, that's a little bit different. You want to hear about some non-spoilery speedrunning tech? Sure. Yes, first they're sour, then they're sweet. That's what it is. I hate those once in a while. Sometimes they're just assholes. Beautiful. Now, rock that looks like a skull. I don't... Oh, he's over here? Oh. Well, I didn't go this far. You didn't get the ice thing yet? No, I can't figure out how to get down there. I know that sounds really silly, but I couldn't figure it out. Oh, uh, all right. I was gonna switch characters, but sure, Flavio. Ah, uh, now what is this? A dead end tempting Flavio with its dead endness. But hmm, is this? Hmm, I think this is the skull route robbery blabbered about. Well, it positively reeks of ancient secrets, yes. Let us plunge into this puzzle. Oh, I will. Hey, yeah, uh, I see some, uh, something blue and something red. I happen to have written that down from our little sea shanty. So I don't remember the specifics of how, but I believe the speedrun pulls off some tech that skips this part of the chapter? Interesting. Well, good luck figuring that out then. Thanks. Forgot about that. I think I know how to, but I'll keep quiet. Right, Doge mentioned- you did mention that. You're like, do you want me to tell? And I'm like, not yet. It results in Flavio following Mario around for the rest of the game! Oh, that's so funny! Alright, let's see. Red 3. I missed. Blue four. Let's see if this works. No, that's not how it is. Okay. Let's see if I need to blow them up that many times. Stone blocks the way. It seems to have been carved into the shape of a skull. There's a space in one of the eyes where you can conceivably put something. Mario, old boy. I got a good feeling that Flavio's gem might fit in that eye hole. Okay. Well, hang on. We'll come back to this red and blue thing. Diana! What's up? It's the redfish bluefish from Dr. Seuss. Hey, Flavio. Skull Captain Cass's gaze, red jewel shines in flame, boom, basso, boom, festival. The Stash Brothers. Oh, he just tells you here. 
Donkey! So many wonderful gamers here tonight. It's it's true. There's so many of you here, and I appreciate it. I appreciate you sticking around for me, uh, coming in a little late. Why are we yelling? Because we're excited! Three times red stash lands on his end. Blue stash belly four times is whacked. Okay. I'm just singing to while away the time. It is not like Flavio was scared or something. But do you know something? I have never been able to know that song's meaning. What is it you may ask of me? You want Flavio to lend you something, is this correct? Now, what could I possibly have that you would need with such anxiousness? Give me that cola. What? You want me to lend you the skull gem? You really, really need it? I can't with this game. What's the matter, Mohawk? This is the heirloom of the house of Flavio, you know. Oh, now even the rocks have better mustaches than me! I'm so sorry, my friend. But I suppose it is alright, because I am Flavio. He of such ludicrous wealth. I'm just lending it, though. Do not dare run off with it. Do not make me dock pay. Ha, <laughs> dock. You get it? It's a sailing term. Here, let me put this in first. I assume that's necessary. Shing! Okay. Now they're active. So, on its end, so I'll probably... One, two, three. And then... Easy peasy! Easy peasy every time. See, I knew that was gonna happen. I knew something like that was gonna happen. That's why I didn't need to write them down, apparently. But I knew. I freaking knew. I mentioned before, but I imagine Flavia with James from Team Rocket's voice. As for Bobbery, I imagine a John Cleese sort of voice. No, no, no. Uh, an old Englishman would definitely work for him. But last week when I established his voice, oh boy, it was not coming to me. I was like, I don't, I don't know if I can manage this. All right. Um, Flavio, can you be a step stool, please? I need to jump on you. No, no, do not worry about Flavio. Just run along and find that treasure. Me, 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 me. The Stash Brothers. Yeah, I did that. No, don't talk to him again, no! I feel like Bobbery would have Sean Connery's voice. Ooh, that's a good one, too. Anything better than the generic pirate voice I gave him. Seriously, what? There's a bomb image up there. Now do I blow this up? <clears throat> no. Sir, good sir, I I'm telling you. Hello? Um, feeling perplexed. Oh, that's still there. Right. Um, huh. Well, I opened it. May I recommend listening to the song again? You may. But I did. I did do that. I mean, I see the bomb symbol up there. Oh! I can throw him up high! That's right. I forgot about that bit. Ah, okay. There it is. There we go. Oh, such excitement! The cave entrance! Hmm? What? Ah, my crystal gem! Oh, my skull gem! M -m Mario, what were you thinking? That gem was part of the house of Flavio! Cursed Stash Brothers. Oh, hey, there it is. Ooh. Oh, what a happy day! Uh, I was hoping it was gonna blow up. That would have been funny. I have my skull gem back. My jolliness has no end! Nope, that wasn't too bad, CD. Borderline? But that's fine. I'll, I'll accept it tonight. Now then, I'm sure you're all disappointed, but Flavio must be heading back now. I cannot let those back at the camp worry me further. You two understand, yes? So, let me know when you need find that glittery treasure, all right? Now, I'm a little- I'm vaguely brain dead tonight. We've had, um... Us, uh... By these four nephews over for about five hours now. And, oh man... 
a lot. It's a lot of chaos. Month, star, day, circle note. Scoffing at danger, my brave explorers entered the cave. Will they actually find the Pirate King's treasure? I tremble with anticipation. Pirate's Grottoes! Yes! Uh, his, his older sister has four boys, and they were all over, and it's a castle. It's a lot. It's a lot, a lot. Ooh, ooh. Oh, the ghosts are back. I'm sure you're exhausted. A little bit. Ah! Oh. Yeah. Mostly, mostly brain exhausted. I'm just like trying to keep track of everybody, you know. I haven't fought these guys yet, I don't think. I have not, in fact. One is exhausting by himself. I don't know about four. Yo, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I forgot I had Miss Mouse. Oh, my God. For now, though, Goombella, tell me about this lava bubble. That's a lava bubble. It's a flame spirit. Max HP 6, attack is 4, defense is 0. Its HP and attack power may be different from an ember's, but otherwise it's the same. Since it's made of fire, try not to touch it, because it'll burn you. Apparently it's vulnerable to explosions and ice attacks. Ah, that's why they gave me that snowman. <sighs> Thank you, Mohawk. Oh, and if you get hit by the flame attack, you might catch fire, so guard well. Ugh. How'd she get burned? How'd she get burned? Ha, guess what? We switch in! Assume this will work on a fire enemy. Noise. Shitty bitty bitty Camilla did not learn. She who lives by the sick burn. Aww. Dies by the sick burn. Didn't want to set the fire enemy on fire? I worry that it wouldn't work. I saw that up there. Let's try that again. Oop. Yo! It's, uh, she's not Cornholio. I don't need TP for my butthole. I mean, sometimes I do. I'm just gonna waste all this HP, no worries. Oop. All right. Yeah, you coming? Oh, he's thinking about it. I don't know why that enemy's right there. But all right. Don't you know who I will? We'll switch to her now. Ooh, that was a close one. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait. Do not trust. Ooh, hoo, 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 hoo. Yipes! Close one indeed. Spooky. Oh! Rude. Ouch. Dang! That was a rough one. Alright, well, I better. No, not head bonk. Tell me about this boy. That's a bullet bill. It attacks after being shot from a bill blaster. Max HP is 2, attack is 4, and defense is 1. Take care of it quickly or it'll totally wail into you, mosh pit style. Use those action commands and take it out. This is the only enemy where you can win by doing nothing? Technically, yes. I'm going to do something, though. Just because I really don't want to tank all that damage. 
That would suck. No, you're right, it's fact. A fact you're correct about. No, I know you wouldn't suggest doing nothing. Oh. Good. Nah, uh, there's bomb. There's also bombs in this game. Yeah, you tell me to blow it up. I know what's up. All right, well, tell me about these. That's a bill blaster. It's the cannon that shoots the bullet bills. Max HP is five. It defense is two. It doesn't attack directly, but it shoots bullet bills at you. I know the bullet bills are annoying, but take out the bill blasters first. Trust me. Ugh. How many of these things is gonna shoot at us? You're so annoying. <laughs> Girl, you're adorable. Holy crap, how much defense you say it had? Doo -doo -doo. Good. Yeah, we got our new partner, Bullet Bill. That would work. Ah, uh, good. I've done good. Bobbery, what can you do for me? Throw three time bombs. No. Really, you can only. Oh, this sucks. I want a chain chomp partner. <gasps> a chain chomp partner would be so good. It'd be like Link's Awakening. Everybody knows he'd go by Bullet Bob. Oh, we gonna do it? Nope. Okay. So this time. Is there bingo cap still at eight? I have not gotten a bingo, no. I don't remember what's that. Stylish. Oh, good. The fog of war is here. Well, I don't mind Goombas. You know what I'd love? A shy guy partner who knows everything? <gasps> yes, please. That would be adorable. Alright, here's what we're gonna do here. If we can. I feel like I feel like it was like five in one stream a few in the next and then nothing yes it was like a whole bunch right at the beginning and then very little yes your 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 tattling partner being a shy guy like a little nerd that'd be phenomenal I would like this very much Okay, good. Oh, I got lucky on that one. Holy crap. I'm in peril. Yeah, Kenshin's Luckometer has no intermediate settings, only high and off. I got some crazy Merlee action in that last hour last week. Let's be honest. <coughs> that doesn't blow them up. Are you serious? Now realizing this. Okay. In that case, we do need a sweet treat. I was thinking we could get away with it, but we cannot! Woo! Yeah, back-to-back -back star points. Not just that, Teddy. Like, right after you left last that night, um, I think we got a third Mer Merle. And then, um, for star points. 
And then after that, we got one for coins. It was ridiculous. Alright, so he's not doing anything, obviously. Um, I need somebody with a better attack. I'm not sure I've got anybody. Well, that worked. Works for me! Mm, there we go. Brain's a little fried. Sorry if that one was a rough one. Oh no! My coin! The entrance, like, sucks you in. It's crazy. Whoop! Getting a little of everybody action in here tonight, I think. Hey, you made it work. That's what matters. Oh. Okay. Why am I falling? Also dying. Oh, because I can just do that. Okay. Oh, oh, it's a giant bomb bomb! Oh my god, it's so cute! No! It's so cute! Also, I might want to heal up. Let's see. Well, hang on to that whack a bump. Just give myself a little heal real quick. Oh, that didn't do as much as I hoped. Oh, I love it. I love it. So, oh my god, there's two of them! Stylish! They're precious. Alright, girl. Tell me about them, though. They big! They is big. That's a bulky bob bomb. I think it's like other bob bombs, but it's huge. Max HP six, attack is two, defense is one. It's weird. It never attacks, but when its fuse is lit, it'll blow up on its own eventually. I don't mind it taking itself out of battle, but that explosion hurts us too. Oh, and when it powers up, that attack powers eight, so watch out. Oh, it's one of those, is it? Firing explosions light its fuse, so I guess setting one off early is one strategy. You can run too, but only but if you're gonna fight it, beat it before it goes off. Okay. Let us. It's already lit, so we might as well Vivi in it. They're so cute! Oh my god. I love them. <clears throat> oh, good, I needed that heart. There's a winch here that raises the sluice gate. You will need a handle to move the winch. Oh, okay. Gotcha. I will look for one. Someone stole the handle! Rude. The monster. Ah, oh, didn't get stylish. Didn't get stylish. Let's go for the goops. Stylish! Rude. Oh no, we got burned. That's okay, Mario's fine. Doo -doo -doo. So stylish. Someday I'll find out what the stylish moves do. Maybe. Oh, we need a, a key. 
save points. Don't mind if I do. no key. How mysterious! Ah, what? Getting it would be key. Ha ha! Yeah. Yes, Teddy? That didn't work. It was only slightly better than Kenshin's joke. <laughs> Is it wonderful today? Just the oh, thank you. I have started doing something slightly different with my hair uh, to try and bring out some of its natural wave, and I, I like how it's going. I like what it's been doing. So, thank you. I'll take it. This is day two of the hair. I'll have to, um... <gasps> the fat bob bombs in the audience. You're right. Holy crap. It makes me want to do the wave in chat. I just, yeah, they're very cute. Um, this is day two of what the hair looks like. I'll have to send you a picture on a day one. Um, when it's really the curls are... Brr, they're, they're about it. Uh, makes me feel like I got a good hair day going on. All right. The two bob bombs side by side. When I fought them, I thought that same thing. They have no fuse. No, they have fuses. They're just very short. Uh, I'll go ahead and multi bounce again. I will not. I take it back. <laughs> Don't you? Yeah. Oh, too soon. Way too soon. Yo, we got a bingo, baby! Oh, and I needed that too! Ooh. Yes! That was needed! Vivian Pouch! Yes! Beautiful! Could not have gone better! Love it. Oh, shoot. My sound was off. Did that go on? Did, did the effects go off? I had to, uh, I had to bring up the five bot real quick. Seven. Eh. 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 I heard it? Okay, good. I, my sound wasn't on, so I was like, Oh no! Oh, righty. Uh oh, Bobbery. Of course. Of course. Where is he? I'm not used to seeing him on the thing. Fling. Too well. Ooh, turn back. Boy, this guy yelling turn back sounds very familiar. That definitely happened in the first game. Should've just done the victory screech manually then. Go no further or you will never leave. I'm good. Yeah! <laughs> <coughs> oh, they're so cute though. There's three of them! It's beautiful. They are lovely. Look at those babies. Kaboom! Um, uh, let's swap. They're precious, aren't they? Let me get some Togepi action in there. And 64 is Toot and Koopa. You think it's Toot and Koopa this time, too? They're not gonna use the same dude again. Oh, never mind. Their defense is too high. I was wrong. Oh, they 
They are very excited here. Or are they? Dr. Dead, how's it going? Well then, I wasted a turn. They're already on fire, so let's get some, some Vivian on. Oh. Music, don't do this. Why does it do this? Does anyone know? Oh, it's defense is up. Oh, I see what's happening here. Well, perhaps I can set it on fire. Tired as usual, my schedule for the week is going to be fun. Really? What you got going on? Music, what have you done? Alright, the attack is boosted now. Oh, and it blew up. Okay, well that works. Might I suggest one tacker for this big ball bomb if you should want one? Sure, I'll take that. Yeah, that was a bit rough, but we made it through. On tonight, off tomorrow, then back till Thursday morning. Ooh. Yeah, that's a bit rough. I'm noticing we got a bomb partner, but there's still a surfing uh, a, a a surfing platform here. A swim pan. Yeah, that I can't use any move is a valid strategy after all. Just, oh. Mm, mm. Almost time for a fish partner. Yeah, I was just thinking that. I kind of expected... I mean, I knew Bob Reeve was coming, but I kind of expected the fish partner to be in the ocean portion? You don't generally get two partners in the same... the same, uh... chapter. These meows could help with those. Oh! Oh, I haven't even tried her in battle yet. Oh, you're right. Ooh. I will, I'll try her in the next one. Totes forgot. Mario, what are you doing, boy? Maybe they'll give us Nibbles as a partner. Mr. Nibbles! Okay. Yeah, okay. I am real bad at doing the things. Yo, my depth perception's never on point. Let's be real. I am, um... I have terrible depth perception. It's awful. Part of the reason I wanted to get a tiny car, which I did, is because I can't see. I got nothing. If I'm in a bigger vehicle, I have no clue. At least in the smaller car. <laughs> At least in the smaller car, I have a better idea of, well, I'm a small car. I'm sure I can actually fit which is not the best way to go about it. You should probably know what you're doing, but I don't. <coughs> no, my depth perception and, like, my brain perception of how big things are is awful. Like, say you've got your room, and you're like, hmm, I'm good to go shopping for a new couch. And then you go to the store, and you look at the couch, and you go, ah, yeah, I think that'll fit. Never trust me if I say that, unless I've specifically measured, <laughs> which I will never remember to do. Uh, because I have no sense of space for how that is. Nina Nintendo, thank you so much for the follow. Ah, oh, I appreciate you. Thank you. Hi, I love this game so much. Yo, I'm having a blast with this game. It's excellent. I went on a tangent about depth perception, but still. <laughs> this game is so much fun. That's what tape measures are for. Can I ask a question? Why is there a supply room in a cave system? Well, I'm assuming it's a smuggler's cave. And thus, um, they've probably set up some sort of, uh, whatchamacallit thing. Let's see. Nah, uh, hang on. I, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna come up with a plan. Oh, uh, alright. Oop, you're too... Ooh, ooh. Do it! Yeah! We in it. We done did it. We were pirate legends, so smuggling would be par for the course. Yeah, exactly. So assumedly they set up this thing as like a hidey hole for all their Arthur. All the 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 
It's my first time playing this game. I'm very excited. It's I'm having a blast with it. Um, as the stream tags say, if you could please not spoil things. If I need help, I may be like, man, how do I do this thing? But I will specifically ask. I'll say, hey, chat, I'm actually asking you, how does this thing work? How do I do it? If I want help. Um... <clears throat> Or if you have something that you want to tell me about the game, and it could be a spoil, just please ask first. Like, hey, I have a tip. Do you want this tip? And I will say yes or no. I appreciate that very much. If you spoil, we will attack with missiles and explosions. Grotto key. Talon is well armed. Do not question his authority. Respect my. Oh god. Nah, I don't really. I don't really. Boy, back to Vivian. Swoop. Actually, I lied. Back to Poop. Oop. I feel like I've got a lot of Shine Sprites. But then I do have two partners, Meows and Bob Bobbery, that, uh... Explosions are fun! That, uh, both need leveled up. Oh, that was a close one again! Oh my god! That's so fast! How are you supposed to do that? I barely touched it! I like walked up against it and it hurt me! Gotta be quick about it. Is that I really want this help question? No, it was not. You touched the barb. I did touch the barb. You're not wrong. Another one? Jeez. Let's see. How do I get that one? Like, I feel like they're really throwing them at me. Like that. <laughs> way, uh, way easier way than I did it. Oh, good. Guys, my depth perception? Get ready. And yeah, I always forget about the invisible blocks. <laughs> Stylish! Kenji did not learn that one shot of glitz fill atrium. Sure didn't. <laughs> yeah, I, I know. I totally forgot. Completely. According to my memory, that was last week. Time works differently for me. Oh no, you guys! Am I gonna get another bingo? Okay. Yeah, get zapped. I like how the fire enemies still get zapped. It's funny to me. Are you Samurai Jack? Never watched Samurai Jack. I don't know. It didn't jump at me at the time. My memory's just really good. Mine's not! My memory's kinda garbage. I also reviewed Wednesday's VOD and no one name coming next week. Excellent. Gotta get back! Oh, man, you guys. That, that Ace Attorney's case is one of my favorites. It's so much fun. I love doing the dumb accent. It makes me very happy. Oh, I didn't mean to strike like that. Oh, I'm gonna get burnt feet. Burn my feet! Well, I know what I'm gonna do. Woo! Aw, oh, man. I almost had it. Just need some HP. Oh, of course. 
just want some HP. Fun, need some attack moves. You're right. I, for some reason, I never think about using them. I don't know what's up with that. Oh, I got burnt. Yo, ouch. Merlin, help! Merlin can only do so much. What do you, what do you mean? <laughs> you know, you heard me. I haven't tried the art attack yet. Power lift? Oh, power lift is something else entirely. The name power lift made me think you, like, lift the enemy out and it goes away. Which I am not interested in, but... Attack and defense power, that's pretty good. That'll come in handy. Yeah, save that for, a. Uh... A time. Alright, I promise I'll start using those at some point. You know what? Mario lifts, bruh. Let's do it. Let's try it. Mario gets swollen, dead lifts the stage. That'd be rad. Got too trigger happy. Trigger happy. Trigger happy havoc. Am I, am I right? Only one boy left. The electricity's texture. Yes, I did see that. Time. Getting close to that level up. I got a bet. Yeah, I know. I need to blow that up. I thought so. Bam! It's such a tiny file. It's just a static image, though. It doesn't need to be big. I struck first, get rooked. That thing did be any good. Speaking of taking Ramba, I got told yesterday I reminded someone of Gonta. <gasps> Oh, our blessed boy. That is a huge compliment. I love it. Let's see. Now, who are we? Who are we? Best compliment ever. Yeah, it being weird. It, white is weird. Yeah, that is weird. Let's see. Um. Do I want to do that? Simultaneously attacks foes and replenishes your own HP. No. Let's see, let's see, what do I want to do here? It being white is actually a common technique in textures. That sounds familiar, I feel like I knew that. Yeah, that was a waste, I know. Dang, a white color can be textured by code. Okay, that does make sense. Example, take away all color except yellow. I see. Yeah, especially so if you have an uh, a, a texture that you might need to use repeatedly in different colors, it would make sense to just use it, make like put it in, excuse me, in white, and then have uh, the programming change the color when you need it to, because that sounds that would be a more efficient use of your space, I suppose. All right, let's see. Good, I can use it on anybody. She's 
heavily for text features for different colored letters. Ooh, yeah, that makes sense. That would do it, for sure. Ha! Ah. There's only one of it and it's still... Rude. Oh, also rude. Then you don't have to make 20 different textures for every color. Yeah, that's definitely way more efficient use of your space. For that, I approve. Hmm. I'm trying to think of Vivian's stylish for that. You get burnt. Oh, it's when she comes back. Gotcha. That'll do it. Just like Bobberies is. That doesn't apply to something like Yoshi, though. Okay. Yeah, I guess. Hmm. Why do I feel like that makes sense for Yoshi? Oh, rude. Great. As his character model as unique. Oh, you. Okay, so you're saying in this game's Yoshi in particular. Yes. I was thinking of like Yoshi's Island where all the different Yoshis exist together. These bullets, though, right? The bullet bills are. Probably my least favorite type of enemy. Just, just obnoxious. Just obnoxious. It's alright. Once we fight the next ones, we'll level up. And it'll be great. Also, now that I know that Vivian is the, the one to use... Is Vivian the best partner? Yo, Generation. In my opinion, I think so. <laughs> but let's ask the conch. Is Vivian the best partner, conch? I didn't pull it hard enough. I'm right. 99.99% positive. Conch agrees. Conch agrees. Oh, I didn't didn't get a didn't get a stylish. Normal Yoshis could be done with regular alpha layers and white colors. Yeah, that makes sense. Do, 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 do. See rocks? Get wrecked. Get out of here, X naught. The fog of war. Yo, we're getting a lot of bingo chances tonight, though. Only one, though. Fog for real. I'm getting. Oh! Pfft. Mario lands on his ass. Keeps coming back. Yeah, the fog is nuts. Boom! We got another level up. Yeah, we got like three last stream. Fetch points. Give me them. I want them. Yes, please. Yo, I have a good supply of coins, too, though. I enjoy this. All right. I have a lot of badge points to spend, actually. Wow. What was I saving for? I don't even remember. What do we got? What do we got? Oh, I scrolled by. All right. Oh, let's get a big boy. Power plus? 
Last stand. Organize. Buy types. Do that. That works for me. I've been taking a lot of hits on on getting attacked, so I think defend would be a smart go. Partner's never really in peril. Yo, let's get... That flower saver could be good. I don't know, I'm not running low on flower points too much. I think what'll help me... Let's give the happy heart P. 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 And then... Salts all ground enemies and burns them as well. Yikes. And then you know what? An FP plus. There we go. That works. We'll do that for now. I'm into it. Yeah, I don't remember specifically what I was saving up for. We'll try out Ma Miss Meows. Meows? I called her Meows again, you guys. Yo, there's four of them. Oh, I didn't even notice I had Ice Smash. That would be smart. J Dog is Canadian. What's up? Welcome tonight. Thanks for coming to, to stop by. I appreciate you. How you doing? All right, let's try out Miss Mouse. Meow, 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 meow. All right, girl, what is up? Love slap, pierces defense. Oh, there it is. That's what we need. And kiss thief, steal an item's badger item. All right. An item's badger item. You heard it here first, folks. Doing good? How's the game going? The going game's going great. This is my first time playing this, and I'm having an absolute blast. Not doing 100... If, hold on, I'm not the best at this game, but I'm having fun with it, and I think that's the important point. Oh, both. I, uh... I missed what was happening there. Don't mind me. Again, not great. First time using that attack. Didn't know what it was about. Oh, okay, Merle. Okay, okay, you can help boost my attack. I'll take that. Going great. It's my first, yeah. <sighs> Emergency multi attack. Yes, uh, appreciate it if no spoilers. Um, if you have the urge to say, no, you need to know this thing I want to tell you. Um, just, just toss out the idea first in chat. Be like, hey, do you want to know this thing? I've never played this game either. I've never played this game, either this one. This one out of two. Sorry, I'm having trouble with your... This is one of the two you've never played in the series, or you haven't played any of the, the stuff? I've only played the one, the original for N64, and this one. They were both blind runs that I streamed. All right, let's try this again. Ah, a little jump! She's so cute. All right, defense is boosted. Mouse don't care. Yo, Mouse! All right, then. Wow, yeah, that's rough. Just a little hop on the way out. It's so cute. Never, I played the original. Uh, Super, Color Splash, and Origami King. Gotcha, gotcha. So, this is the one you missed. I can tell you it is very good. I'm having a great time. Wow, another one? Oh, oh, Sticker Star, that's the other one. You're right, you did miss that one. I was wondering why I was only doing two, but I forgot I have power up plus. Wow, I didn't do very much. Okay. Uh, 
Oh, hello. Want to get around to playing all of them? Absolutely. This one's such a blast. Okay. Whew. Whew. That bomb's losing it. I gotta get. I gotta get my new partners boosted. I need some more attack on them. More swimmy bits. Yolo. We're awful deep into this. Oh, here's the treasure. Another swim panel, indeed. Oh, it's not a partner? York. Unfortunately, I hate sharing my opinion on the Paper Mario series because it's like 20 minutes in Discord server. These OG fans crapped at me for liking the newer games. Yeah. Yeah. It's never fun when you're like, I like this series, and I like even the stuff that's not as popular. Or, I like all of it. And people give you crap for that. No worries. I don't really stand for that here. Um, in this house, you're welcome to in your opinions, even if we don't necessarily share them, and we're definitely not going to tell you that you are wrong or bad for having opinions, because, man, calm down. It's a video game. <laughs> so... I like to hear that you like the newer games. That's great. Yeah. So, yeah, I admit I don't like the new games, but I'm not going to yell at you for liking them. Yeah, every, everybody's entitled to their own opinion. I don't like Mint. You might like Mint. I'm not going to tell you you're wrong. It's all good. This is a safe space. Speaking of Mint, York Peppermint Patties. York. Purists are jerks, Diana. You're right. Oh, sweet, sweet salvation. I see that badge back there. I'll get it. I thought no one would ever come. I had given up. What's that? Spare you the prologue and just curse you already. <laughs> now, how did you know I was going to do that? How indeed. No, seriously, hang on a sec. Can't you just listen to my spiel for a bit? I've been locked here forever, bored stiff, doing nothing but practicing this speech. Huh? I'm already the fourth cursing, cursing chest you've met? Are you serious? So, you're saying you know exactly how this is going to turn out. Man, talk about a raw deal. You're a twisted little guy, you know that? Okay, fine, fine, fine. I get the picture, okay? Oh, I still gotta find a... A key for this guy, don't I? Okay, hurry up with curses. Well, first I said I liked Super Mario. They replied, correct opinion. Oh, when they start with that. And as soon as I said I liked the newer ones, things went downhill. Oh, goodness, nah, screw that. Sticker Star is the only one I'm not overly fond of, but the new games have good qualities to them. Yeah, we don't like to make people feel bad for liking something. I actually kind of liked uh, Sticker Star. If we all had the same boring, that'd be boring. Mega, mega boring. Super mega boring. Sheesh, all I wanted was to see the face of some unlucky soul when I popped out. Is that so much to ask? No. Anyway, what are you waiting for? Hi, Just open it already. J-Dog, thank you for the follow. I appreciate you. Welcome to the Sweat Squad. You know what the key looks like, Mr. Seen it all already? Some ghost here has it. So just beat him, get it, and we'll get this farce over with. Come on, I'm waiting. Oh, it's you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> thank you, here's Bo slapping continuously. Yes! Bow is great! I love me some bow. I didn't mean to jump! Crud, I got distracted. I mean, I love Transformers, and I won't let you forget it. <laughs> ah. But if you don't, I will joke gasp, and that's pretty much it. Ah, yeah. Bo is my baby girl in that game. Yeah, she's so good! I love her! Love her so much. Ugh. Yes, we're burnt. I get it. Yo, I needed that nice. No, don't jump. Don't jump. Gosh, these poop to start with. Dang. You will. Just fine. 
I really won't let you forget it. Ooh, lucky! The rest of chat will vouch for that. That's true. Talon will not let you forget his love of Transformers. Alright, hang on. This is the correct way. Doo -doo -doo, stylish. Is that the one where the kids transform into animals, or...? That reminds me. Yes, Diana? What's up? I got a key! Is it? Me in there! P down, D up. Drops the damage Mario deals and receives by one. Oh, that could be interesting. Alright. Yeah, yeah, whoop de doo You got the key, party time. Now let me out already. I was gonna give you the- I was giving you the opportunity to remind me, Talon. Alright, here you go. Since you're just itching to get this over with. Ahem. Wee hee hee. Fools! Yes. Hello, evil face. You dopes fell right for my absolutely brilliant trap, and now you will suffer. Oh yeah, I'm so evil, bathe in that foul, awful... Uh, wait, what was next? Oh yeah, you fools will be cursed forever with your appalling stupidity! You will rue the day you open this chest of doom! Now, you wretched guy! Line! Be cursed! Oh, it's already beginning the yawning! After playing Mario and Luigi games, when I play these games in CPP, I'm like, badge points and bro points, and I just get confused. That's fair. Now you've been cursed, but good! Suffer, suffer, suffer! Wait, maybe that's too much. You alright? That didn't really hurt, did it? Wee hee hee hee, good! Squirm and suffer like socially awkward worms! How did he know I was a socially awkward worm? From now on, in certain places, when you press Y, you'll turn into a paper boat! Oh, he's a nice one. Isn't that just gruesome? Alright, just try it so I can see the depth of your humiliation. Feel the terror of your fate. When you stand on one of these boat panels, the panel will curse, feel your curse and glow. Really, I was wondering why you never noticed the boat. Me never noticing a boat? Yes, yeah, stand here, slime, feel the pain. I'm a boat. Oh my god, my little feet are down there. Whee! Yes, such suffering! I guess there is a little boat on the panel. In my defense, still could have been... Still could have been a partner. Do you feel the horror? Now you're a pilly little boat! Whee! Oh, I'm sorry, guys. Oof. He's made faces come to life again, I see. I just now noticed the boat, to be fair. I'm hella extroverted online in IRL. I want a 69 foot radius between me and people. I'm generally introverted at all times. Um, I might seem vaguely outgoing and and loudish. I don't know. I mean, it's so pretty chill, but like, I'm I'm pretty talkative on stream. But that's because you need to be. <laughs> if you met me in real life, I would absolutely not be like this, unless we really got to know each other, and I was very comfortable. I hope this isn't in place of a swimming partner. Sushi was my fave from the original, so I've been kind of waiting for the swim partner. That's a mood and a half. Oh, it's super cute, yeah. Well, we might... There might be time for at least one more partner. I'm not really sure. Why am I the only one with super detailed observation? Because that's your talent, Talon. Not all of us are so blessed. You float on the water, people will laugh at you. You will be spit upon. But it only works in certain places, so don't worry. It's not too bad. Yeah, because you're awesome like that, Talon. I'm a boat, motherfucker. Don't you ever forget. When you want to return to normal, press the... Bleh, 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 bleh. Now try it, worm. I noticed his face. He's got two eyes. Yo, Teddy, that's a big deal. Yes, your pain is like a tasty banquet to me. Uh, run that by me again? Nope. Ooh, I get it. It does? Then off with you, you jaded, cursed boat guy. Oh, and hey, listen. Thanks for letting me do my thing. I feel better. You're welcome, friend. Glad to be of service. 
Talon is one letter away from having the word talent. That's why you've got so many talents. J Dog is right. Absolutely. Uh, you think this guy in the chest? Oh, it's Cooper. Sorry. Uh, you think that guy in the chest is actually on our side? Yeah. About that. <laughs> Who knows? All right then. Yes, my name has been autocorrected many times. Oh, it's so cute! Look at the little boat! Very adorable. Now. I'm trying to see if there was something back there, perhaps, but I guess not. Plot twist. It's the same ghost the whole time. That would be a good twist. All right. Now what can we find? Hopefully something good. All the way back there, rude. I'm gonna put that defense on myself. Oh, this again? All right, hang on. Let's get let's get my girl out here. J Dog, you will. Damn it. Be uh be glad to know that the ghost in this one is my girl in this one. I love her so much. Vivian is my best. This part sucks though. Sweet hat, thank you very much. Oh, jeez. Oh. Ooh. Get me out of here. So now that you have no reason to go back there ever again, I can give you some info that'll make you slap your head. Yes, please. I, w I will accept this. Let's see. Is there anything more up here? Let me save. You could have used tube form to go into the spikes. You're right, I could have. I even noticed that there was one point where the spikes dipped lower. Yeah. Yep. Yep! And, I, and, and as I was trying to frantically use Vivian to duck in and out, I was like, Oh, if only I could just duck. <laughs> if only I could duck! <coughs> Well, you live, you learn, you get loves. That reaction was totally worth it. Well, you are welcome. I didn't know you could do that with Vivian. It was it was rough. It took it took a while. I don't recommend it. Uh, you should definitely do it the proper way. Let's see. Was there another? Yes, there was. That's what I thought. Go. Oh, I found a secret hidey hole. Hey, doesn't a partner in this game have big jugs? Oh, yes. She's got huge stage presence and jiggle physics. You can't really see it from here, but trust me when I say those um those tracks of land. Are bouncing. Yo, defend plus P. Heck yeah. I'll leave her out for now. You're not wrong. What is this Xenoblade? Ha! Puffs. Beautiful. <coughs> what about here? Okay, so not all the waterfalls have crap behind them. I just got lucky. Oh, and that's nothing else back here. Okay. Okie dokie. It was worth it. Don't remember.
remember what was back here already. So we're just gonna double check. Ah, it was just that. Okay, so I got the thing that was here. Now we can continue to backtrack. And fall in the water, maybe. Oh, what if this is blue? You know what? Hang on. YOLO! Thought so. Oh, I still need the crank for the winch! Right. Right. Still looking for that. Okay, okay. I just texted Teddy about that. What, the, uh, going over the waterfall, or? Yo. Hey, we got it. The big waterfall, yeah. Well, at first I was afraid it was gonna suck me over. And then it turns out that would have been fine. All right, um. Now. You are not the one for this fight. Oh, hey, rude. Didn't like that. Didn't like that at all. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna try the art attack. It's giving me an art attack, eh? Okay, let's try it. Draw around the enemy as many times as you can. Is that... How do this work? Oh god. Didn't work very well. Oh. Oh, I see. Continuous. Wow. Alright. I was just sitting there like, it's not ending. This isn't ending yet. I don't know what's going on. <clears throat> Oop. Bye, Coop. Today I had to relieve my PTSD and fight the fiery piranha plant in the volcano. I honestly don't remember how bad that was. Was that that bad? You just have a bad experience with it. Two phases of straight pain. Dang. Oh, you know what? That's the thing. No. Ice smash. What's that? Oh, it just freezes enemies? Where is this to use ice smash? 3 PP, FP. Which can freeze and immobilize an enemy if it's ex ex executed so quickly. Hmm. Guess what? Oh, tell me, Talon. Please tell me it's okay. Eh. Oh, yeah, he makes things hot for you. My 2DS XL is coming in the mail soon? Heck yeah! I never got the XL, and I never got the DS, or the 2DS. I don't know, I got my 3DS, and that was all I really felt like I needed. Good. Good, Mario. One of the UHD Blu-ray discs has finished converting? Oh, heck yeah! It only took you, like, 24 hours. That one wasn't my fault. That one I just slid off. Mario! What is your deal? You know what? I think I was supposed to do this. The 2DS XL was fantastic. I loved it. Now the weird thing, a regular Blu-ray disc converted and it's 12 gigs. I have the baby-sized 2001 3DS that I got a hand cramp after playing with it for five minutes. I have, um, the small 3DS. 
probably from about that era. It's just the Zelda one. It's not the best quality. There's like plastic bits coming off. I'm pretty unimpressed, I gotta be real. Ah, there we go. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, well, that freaky voice is making a noise again. That ghost must be nearby. Well, we will find them. Shortly. Whoop. Actually, I probably should have gone this way. Blue Yoshi, indeed. His name is Togepi. I was thinking it might be quicker to go that way, but, uh, it wasn't. You ride the little Yoshi. He's just a baby, but it, you, you ride him. He's shiny. Yeah, we named him Togepi because he comes to you as an egg. It's very cute. You get to name him, J-Dog. It's the best. They're like, what do you want to name this guy? And I'm like, oh, yes, please. So why is the UHD so much smaller than the regular Blu-ray? I could not tell you, Talon. That is beyond my expertise. Alright. Oh, we're in here now. Okay. That do go this way. Hello, this room. Oh, yeah, that. Great. Okay. Yeah, I kind of had a feeling. Oh, Ooh. like a freaking wave pool. Ooh. God, this is like Mario sixty four. Press on! Uh. Oh, ass. <laughs> this is, um, a little bit... T Those waves be brutal. You're not wrong. Good. Good. At least I'm not losing HP this time. Uh. 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 Okay. Oh, no! Oh god, no! Woof, woof. Woof. Dodge him! Oh, god, at least there's more room to maneuver over here. Yo, we did it. Yo! No! I looked away for two seconds! Serpentine! Pull a slam! Bob and weave! I thought no more were gonna spawn where I was. I was betrayed! God. Nobody told me I'd have to do platforming in this game. It's alright, we did it. Hey, something's coming. They're floating on the water. Oh my god. What? Also, are you not amused by the cardboard waves? No, no, I love the waves. They're great. Is that a... Is that a boat? Hey, over here! Save us, please! I'm coming. What even? This looks exciting! What is that? Well, that was pointless! It's made out of paper! They're all patchwork. Their heads are patchwork. I was trying to decide if they were just dirty or not, but no. Very almost dead. I think I'm all gonna fit on the paper boat. Oh. Interesting. Ooh. This is an interesting area.
Oh good, more paper airplane time. Of course I know the trick now, so we're good. No, Teddy told me the trick. We're all good. Oh. I guess I need to do the trick better. Oh, I think I need to go through all of these. Yeah, I'm a master now. Oh, hang on. No, no. Well, that was a letdown. Talon, do you want me to still be bad at it? I'm sure the answer is yes, because uh, failure is more entertaining than success sometimes. Oh, right in the water. <laughs> oh, good. That one hurts me. I, uh... Okay. Not what I meant to do. Now I'm too good. Now I can't get the one that sucks. Mario do be hurting a little bit. Um... Hoping to get into another fight and use Sweet Treat a couple of times, but it's, uh... I got... This section always reminds me of the Pirates of the Caribbean music. Yeah. I need that song. I need that, that theme on there. So I've got some stuff. I got the Life Shroom, keeping it in for in a pinch. We got the, the Whack-a-Bump. A lump of something. Uh, we got the jam and then we got the ultra shroom. Ah, I never want to use these. Sweet treat is a bit weak now. Maybe I should use the ultra shroom. And I'll save the whack a bump for in battle. Gentlemen, you will always remember this is the day when you almost caught Jeff. My favorite pirate meme is where it's like it's the clip of the very first shot you see of him in the first movie. Where he's on the boat and he's sailing in and the boat is slowly sinking. Right as a completely... He just gets to the dock and just hops off perfectly. And it's like... I don't know, seniors on their last gear. And they're just like riding the sinking boat until they can leave. It's great. I love that dumb meme. I wish I grew up with the GameCube and all those old games. But I grew up with the DS, the Wii, the 3DS, the Wii. Oh, but the DS was a... The DS and the Wii were a glorious era. They were amazing. Personally, I, um, I, uh, grew up with an NES and a Super NES, uh, Super NES, uh, the Super Nintendo, and then the, f I, uh, the first system I got when I was old enough to be like, yeah, this is definitely my game, was the N64, but I played all of them, so... Technically, I'm older than the Super Nintendo. Not by much. I've, I think I have a false memory of us getting our first Super Nintendo because I looked back at the, the year and I was like, it doesn't work. It doesn't work whether you were what. But no, I mean, the DS and Wii era was a, an amazing time, so don't, don't feel that bad. And especially, you can go back and play all the old games now. Well, most of the old games. Some of them with ease depending on. There we go. That's what I want to do. No! <laughs> okay, thank God. They gave me that one. They let me have that. Yo! I know, I'm impressive, aren't I? This is the quality content you guys watch for. Hey, we can cross now. Hey! Hey, hey, what are we waiting for? Let's go! Yo. All them toads, let's get out of here. Glad I could be a service. Wow, it's a lot of toads. Yo! And the, oh, the Beyonce couple! Oh my god! The Beyonce couple was down there. I come for the streamer, you're not wrong. Oh, hey, long time no see, guys. Fancy meeting you here. Did you count them? No, I didn't count them. Shoot, I probably should have. I don't know how you did it, but 
You saved us. We came here looking for that pirate treasure, and well, we sucked. Our ship got sucked, surrounded by ghosts out on the ocean, and we ended up here. I count 200. Oh, hey, aren't you Mario? I do not remember the voices I gave those two. I know you just second-guessed yourself with the booze. <coughs> it's me, me, Don Pianta's daughter, Francesca. Fran... Francesca? I don't know. There's at least eight of them. And Frankie's here, too. After my dad forgave us, we set out on a boat trip. I like how she's wearing a ring, but it's an ent it's her entire mitten hand. <laughs> Look at that. That's amazing. The ship we were on got a little too close to this island, and now look at us. Still, I'm amazed the rumors about Cortez were true, which means he's nearby. You have an interesting definition of forgive. Hey, so by the way, what are you doing here? Don't tell me Daddy had you come here to take us back. Our dad's the head of a mafia, by the way. j Dog. What? You're after the pirate's treasure because it might contain a crystal shard? Well, I think the treasure's right in there, watched by Cortez's spirit. Yeah, I'm sure you'll be able to take care of him, though. You look tough. I am tough, thank you. Besides, Cortez is the one that trapped us on that raft, so smack him one for me. Yes. I've been calling the stars shards. It is non-negotiable, uh, because I've played... Quite a lot of Kirby 64, the Crystal Shards. So, Crystal Shard is a phrase that's ingrained in my brain. So I see Crystal Star and cannot pronounce it. <laughs> oh, I'll smack him one good for you, darling. What you what you say, Frankie? Frankie and I are just so in love anytime, anywhere. No matter how dank. You're allowed to be wrong? Wow, Diana. Well, you pudding pie cooler, will you? Uh, I mean, come on, babe. Everybody's watching. What about you? Getting out of here is treasure enough for us. But how do we get out? Well, you go in and fight Cortez, and we'll think of a way out. How's that? Yeah, you do that. Whoa! Okay, Tally. Okay. Well, look who it is! Whoa, did I surprise you? Oh, sorry about that. See, I actually followed you in here, but I got lost along the way, and, uh... Well, anyway, I followed this path, and I finally caught up with you, and then... Listen, just forget it, okay? I'm sure the Crystal Shard's inside that pirate ship. And the Pirate King Cortez is in there, too, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, probably. No big deal, though, right? You can take him, big guy. We're counting on you. Boy, I know I sure am. And so is Grotus. Bro? You just gonna say it? You just gonna come out and say it like that? Wow. You say so. Also. <sighs> I didn't realize this was here. I would've just used it. Uh, I'm gonna do it. I got tons of coins at this point. Four eyes is not subtle. Alright. I'm getting awful... I'm getting some deep, deep golden sun vibes from this area. Oh. <coughs> There's a certain boss in the original Golden Sun who is the hardest boss in the game. He's an optional side boss. Boy, am I getting those vibes here. Way at the bottom of a super deep cave. A treacherous, it goes on forever. You just go deeper and deeper and deeper. I thought you were going to say Dire Dire Docks. No, I, I feel that too. But, um, it's the spooky music that keeps it from feeling like Dire Dire Docks because, um, Dire Dire Docks and Jolly Roger Bay are both very, um, kind of chill musical pieces. Whereas this is a very spooky area. Ooh, you ignored my warning. Ooh, come inside the door and be lost in darkness. Perhaps the ghost ship... Uh, there's not enough room in that ship for that hallway. Uh, yeah, perhaps the ghost ship from Wind Waker that I only vaguely remember because it's been like 15 years since I played Wind Waker. By the way, Wind Waker is coming after Ace Attorney. I think I mentioned that, but I'm saying it again. Who is it? Who is it? 
Ooh. Come into my... Ooh. Hey, there's a crystal. There's a crystal shard. Oh my god. No! You know who it is! It's the Skull Pirate from, uh, from Donkey Kong Country 2! Who chases you? <laughs> Who chases you on the roller coaster? <laughs> oh my god, yes! <sighs> oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> I'm so happy. Enough, I grow tired of the spooky ooh business. What a cameo. I'm a pirate blasted. Pirates do not moan. Unless they're getting some, am I right? I'm a cold-blooded villain who robs innocents of life and loot. Not a crying ghost. Yeah, the blue eyes. That's interesting. Is his name Cackle? I can never remember. I don't remember most of the, the names of the, the, the enemies in that. Let's be real. But maybe Cackle. In Transformers, that means you're a good guy. I don't think this guy's a good guy. And you are after my treasure! Are you asking for a challenge? And this... This is my ship. What are you doing here? Speak! I'll turn your mustache into a bone polisher, amigo! Yo-ho-ho-ho-ho-ho! That's an amazing laugh. Oh my god, that's an amazing pirate laugh. Yo-ho-ho-ho-ho-ho! Beautiful. Oh, this song is rocking. Yo, look at him! He looks intense! This dude looks nuts! This looks like the Skull Dancer from Tales of Symphonia! Yes, please! Bone Pile Cortez. I feel like I should attack this Bone Pile, but I'm gonna jump on his head first. And then let's give us a little swappy swap. Oh no, the Skull Dancer! Am I wrong? Good luck! Thanks, Generation! Yeah, that Skull Dancer is such a pain. All right, I can only look at Cortez and not the pile of bones. That's Cortez. He's the dreaded pirate spirit who haunts the island. Max HP is 20. Ha, there's going to be two phases for that, I can guarantee it. Attack his four defenses once. Agreed, I died so much when I fought him back in the day. Oh yeah, he's a tough one. Hi, ninja. Ninja's back. How you doing, girly? Hi. I wonder if I'll be able to take him out at 10 HP. Is that what you're going for? His HP may seem low, but he's a spirit, so even when his HP hits zero, he'll come back. I had a feeling there was something like that. Plus, he has a ton of different attacks. He's as tough and scary as he looks. I'd say just keep damaging him, and sooner or later he'll go down for good. Let's give this tormented soul some eternal rest. It was easy for you at 20? Yeah, how far much farther are you, Talon? Did you did you beat this already? Ugh. Didn't even get to 10. Alright, what do we got? What do we got? Uh oh, I'm very much out of um. Is she watching? I swear she's watching. Oh, where are you going? I was putting the spotlight on you. You pretty much beat it already? Yeah, I kind of figured. There you go, girl. There's my kitty. We got the kitty cam. We got the kitty cam. We'll see. I'm gonna try and jump on the bone pile. Never mind, I'm not gonna jump on the bone pile. I think I see what's happening. Sure. Let's um bring out our own ghost girl. I just noticed your shirt is that Patrick. Yes, it is. Um, there's a great story that goes with it that I know I've told. I'm sure I told it on stream. I can't remember if I told it. I don't remember the last time I did tell it, but oh, hang on, to catch your hand. This is Patrick. Oh, I hit the wrong button for a second. Stylish! My name's not Rick! So, 
So, um... Oh, uh, let's see. Oh, I was not looking. This is dangerous. This game's hard sometimes. It's hard to tell- hard to sit here and tell a story, because you'll get attacked. Um... So, in, like, high school and, uh... College and stuff after... Vipey was well known for wearing a Spongebob shirt. He wore it forever, until it was completely threadbare and awful. Um, and eventually, a couple of, four or five years ago, a while ago, we were like, he was like, I'm gonna buy you a Patrick shirt. So he bought me a Patrick shirt to go with his Spongebob shirt. And there was one time we went to the zoo. And we were like, <laughs> you know it'd be funny if we wear a Spongebob and Patrick shirt? So we were wearing our Spongebob and Patrick shirts to the zoo. And we drove, oh, we drove. We walked by this kid and his mom, just kind of chilling. We're holding hands as we walk and chatting a little bit. And as we pass, the kid looks at us, and then he says out real loud to his mom, he's like, I bet they're best friends. And it was, it made my life. It's the best. I love that kid for saying that. It was beautiful. It's like, yes, we are, kid. Yes, we are. It was, it was wonderful. Please? Wow, I didn't dodge any of those. That sucked. I'm assuming I can't hit him with the hammer. No, I can only go for the- well, I can go for the bone pile. Yeah, that was a rough one. Okay, so that works. We can do that. Dang. Rain's not happening quite as not as good as you. Okay, bye. As much as I'd like. Wow, things are really dropping. I don't know. Okay. He's back. But we both got both got happy, so that's good. Let's see. What you got? Oh. You want it? Thank you. If you want it. I, I will. Thank you, babe. <coughs> I just told the, the, the story of us being at the zoo wearing our SpongeBob and Patrick shirts. Oh, classic. It's a classic. It's so good. Somebody needs to fix that stage. Yeah. Robby Pizza! So don't mind me. Oh, no, it's so saucy! <clears throat> the nephews are still over, so he's. He just brought me some pizza and bounced. Okay. I assume I just need to go through couple of rounds of this. So let's, um, let's bust out some Power Smash. Yeah, this pizza's, this pizza's hidden. Tastes good. Hope to have pizza tomorrow. Nice. Yeah, get your Teddy Pizza emotes. I had some last weekend, it was good. Had some today? Yo, it's pizza weekend, guys. Ooh, I don't like that. Just a frozen one? Yeah, I don't know where they got this. They probably might have got a frozen one. Who knows? <clears throat> I want pizza. That was an interesting thing that just happened. Yo, get burnt. Ugh. That was rough. Didn't like that one.
One more round, maybe? Oh. I see. Oh, I still got another. Okay. Well. Beefy boy, indeed. Let's see. He does look like a skull dancer, doesn't he? How could he be beefy? He's got no flesh. You're not wrong, Talon. He does have that many, that many forms. Ooh, I got lucky there. I didn't realize he was gonna be first. Where's the second one? It's gonna be here. It's gonna be here. Oh, and of course I got it. Okay. Okay, cool. Cool. Well, that's fine. Vivian needed him more than anyway. He does have a beefy hat. A more powerful sweet treat later in the game would be great. Yeah, I'm assuming we don't get one. Because it's already pretty outclassed. Yeah, like Snootless. Ooh, that is a cheese crust. It's a stuffed crust! No, that was rad! Vivian, my girl! That was beautiful. Hell yeah, darling. Oh, can't use that anymore, damn. much can I do with multi bounce? Not much, apparently. Good. Good. We'll try it again next turn. Arrgh! I can't take much more of this. This calls for something special. Now you will see the true mind of my spirit form! Holy crap! <clears throat> that was nuts. That was absolutely nuts. Ow! Wow. Oh, I was not thinking multi bounce. I was thinking of the continuous one. Multi jump or whatever. Help, he's eating me! Hang in there, chat! Why did I sit on the right side of the stage? Yeah, half the audience was just murdered. Let's throw a rock at Mario! Yeah, he totally deserves it, right? God, that move is so good, Viv. My girl. She's beautiful. Look, somebody said- Somebody didn't learn their lesson. Look who's back for more. Yeah. Yeah. Do -do -do. At least the Totem Puny had enough sense to leave. Vivian's fire jinx and what is why. I love that flower saver. Yeah, I didn't realize how damn good it was. It's insane. And it's really, the inputs are really easy. It's not like, it's hard. Damn, that was a good one. Vivian made that fight. Let's, let's be real. No, oh, my treasure! It wrecked Cackle. Got him. I'm 
Yo ho ho ho, you're foolish, amigo! Or I'm not actually dead. I think you are. I think you're actually dead. Well, technically I was already dead, but my spirit endures lying tied to my treasure. So you cannot do anything to me. I do not live, amigo! Still, guarding this treasure for hundreds of years is almost as boring as death. You just give me the treasure and I'll leave you alone. What? You're not even interested in my treasure? Then why are you here? Huh? You want this, amigo? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's a little rock over here. Are you serious? Yes, please. Well, that's no big deal. Here, take it. Oh, I need one or two extra gems for. I did not really like that one anyway. <coughs> Why didn't you say that before? Yeah. You got the crystal shard. Beautiful. Sweet feast? Is that an upgraded sweet treat then? Sure sounds like it. I mean, okay, sure. Whoa, a more powerful sweet treat. What a complete surprise that one saw coming. Thanks, Talon. Cortez Scrooge, Scourge, excuse me, Scourge of the Seas. Mario soundly, de soundly defeated the fearful spirit and claimed the Crystal Shard. Perhaps the peaceful citizens of the world no, no, no longer need fear, Cortez and his fellowship. The only problem remaining is how Mario would escape this isolated island. And could there be another problem still? Hiding be beneath our hero's nose? Who could guess? Super Kirby 879 hello! Welcome! Thanks for stopping by tonight. Hope you're doing well. Well, that should do it. You don't need anything else, so away with you, amigo. Well, keep by. <laughs> Month, star, day, circle star. And then I heard something my ears could not believe. We hadn't actually discovered the legendary treasure of the Pirate King Cortez. Oh my god. It's going good here. I got some pizza that I'm jamming on. Try not to eat it too obnoxiously, but, uh, you know, it's pizza, so it's gonna be difficult to do. Playing this rad game. Having a good time. I was like, how do I get out of here? I know I can make that jump. Super Kirby, you a big fan of this game? Just curious. Goes well, just enjoying our lovely potato friend playing this for the first time. Whoa, that was like an earthquake in there. You alright? You can jump off the rock the first time. Did you not? Or are you just surprised that I did? Which is fair. Yahoo! Oh wait, is that, um... I didn't see who was talking there. I'm gonna assume it's the Pianta. Meanwhile, I had to try like six times. I'm surprised I made it, Talon. I'll be real with you. Oh, Yahoo! You be Cortez? Oh wow, you're really some. Yeah, I know that you've got some free time. Why don't you get us out of here? Um... Hey, look! All that shaking caused this wall here to crack a bit. I feel a breeze. We could break down this wall. I think we could escape. I guess that's not much help. Or is it? What? Breeze? How are we gonna bust through solid rock, though? So you failed in your task, then? Alright, out of my way. Crowd parts surprisingly easily. Watch out! Good, of course that doesn't count. Nope. Yes. Yes! Ha! It worked just like I said! Well, me first. Rude. Come on, everybody! Let's get out of here! This damn cave air is just not good for my skin. Let's go, Frankie! Uh, what do the- uh, uh, I can't count, they're too fast! I can't count them, Doge! You saved our lives, man. I'll never forget you, but I need to leave now. Goodbye. 
Man, you know what I would hate? What would you hate, Talon? Beach Toad had something to say before getting out of the cave. It sounds like something Earthbound would do to you. Hey, man, thanks. Yeah, thanks, man. Oh, that's super cool, man. Bye. Oh, I really appreciate you, dude. <coughs> Does it not? Be Let's be honest. I'm at the final chapter of this game. Kirby. Very nice, Kirby. Yes. Since this is my first playthrough, I very much appreciate it. No spoilers. Spoilers. <laughs> Trying to, uh... Have a very pure experience as much as possible. God, they're everywhere. Yeah, good thing they didn't for sure. Well, hello, sir. Ah, uh, Mario. Welcome back to you, my stalwart captain. So, have you found the treasure? How is our little expedition faring, hmm? What? Oh, what? The spirit of Cortez was guarding the treasure. And you beat him, but you left all the treasure there? Yeah, you're welcome to go beat him yourself if you want the treasure. Arr, what were you thinking? Were you trying to be nice? Aw, oh, well. That's what I like about you, I guess. Mario be like, excuse me, excuse me, coming through, excuse me. Could it be? Brother? Oh, You. What are you doing here? I, I came looking for you, brother. All the way to this island I came looking. But ghosts attacked us and our boat just sank. But I found you now. Huh? Your boat sank too? So you're all stranded here as well? Yes. Hello? What? Hold on. Huh? What was that? Got me. And yet Mario can still get email. <clears throat> ah, what was that? How did the how come the ghost didn't come get this ship? Pardon me, guys. Whoa, I mean. <laughs> yeah, all right. So sorry to surprise you. No, wait. No need for that fake politeness anymore. Good job getting the crystal shard. Oh, yeah, seriously. Good job getting it for me. Oh, my God. Another absolute surprise that nobody was expecting. Boy, now, ain't that that good fella Four Eyes? Yeah, that is Four Eyes. What's he doing over there? Hey, Four Eyes, it's dangerous up there. Huh. What's with this lukewarm reception? Dramatic entrance here. Oh, whatever. I'll spell it out for you idiots. You may have known me as Four Eyes. But I'm actually... Oh, boy, boy, the Great Lord Crumb! Crumply! Oh, man, did I fool you. I was the mastermind in the shadows, ruining this voyage. Oh, running this voyage. It hurts to be so good. Oh, no, it's Lord Crump. I can't believe the toads are actually this clueless. <laughs> actually, yes, I can. <coughs> now, Mario, enough of this. I'm on a schedule here. Hand over the crystal shard. Old man Crumply. Because <clears throat> you know what'll happen if you don't. He was ruining the voyage, too, let's be real. I would have gotten away with it, too, if... Oh, wait, I did get away with it. Oh, wow, what a shock. Starboard cannons! Board cannons! Fire, fire, fire! Bruh! I think Four Eyes was a pirate all this time? Oh, it's Flavio. Madness! Well, what are we standing around for? Cannons, people, we must flee! Wait, are we manning the cannons or are we fleeing? There's two different things here. Uh, look, we're sailors. We're not much good for anything without a ship to sail. Wait... I have it. I'm a genius. We have a ship at hand, and a fine one, I must say. Mario, take me. To Cortez! We have cannons? I know, right? Yes, my brain remembered what you said. You said Cortez had a ship! The legend is true that we should be unstoppable in that cursed ship. Okay, can we, can we run while we're talking about this? We have a Paper Mario boat. <laughs> Casual dialogue while we're under cannon fire. I hate that he actually has a good idea. Flavia, what are you talking about? That's crazy! This is Cortez the pirate you're talking about here! What if Mario did beat him? Why would he lend you a ship? He'll cream you! Cream you! 
X not to the stormtroopers of the Mario world. Hey, I may be a coward in the CAD, but I still lead you. I have a duty to protect you. Did we beat him? Debatable. We will be cannon fodder if we sit here and wag our tongues. We must at least try, Cortez. I want to hear no complaints. I am your leader, and I will not... Oh, I will negotiate with this Cortez. I will not negotiate with terrorists. Now, Mario, take me to those pirates come this instant. Okay. Well, we'll just leave everybody else standing here. That's fine. They can take it. They can take the hits. Yeah? Fine. The Mario ship is way too small. You're, you're right. But it's something. <laughs> Always gotta do a quick savey save. Never know when you might totally eat it. Hey, Cortez! Long time no see! Use some of that partner in Mario's hat technology. Quick, everybody, get in my hat. I'll save you. Get in my hat. I'll turn into the boat. I'll just sail away. It'll be fine. Oh, what's up, Cackle? Ooh. Oh, what? It's you again? Did you forget something? Oh, yeah, I dropped my wallet. Did you find it? <laughs> Cortez, I've come to speak with you. Just jam everyone in the party break room. C -c Could you possibly lend me your sh sh ship? What? What would possess you to lend me? What would possess me to lend you my ship? And who are you anyway? Oh, my name's Flavio. We are in big trouble, and we could really use your ship. Don't step on Coop's magazines, though. We must protect our crew from bad pirates that are blasting us to bits. So we just need to borrow your ship for a teensiest little while. Man, I put too much thought in this whole concept. No, I love it, Talon. What are you talking about, muchacho? I do not rent this ship for pleasure cruises. And even if I did lend it to you, the ship is magical and it cannot move now. The key to powering the ship is a mystical skull gem. As opposed to good pirates who shipwrecked you? The skull gem? You mean this? Shing! Sparkle, sparkle. You want the skull gem? Uh, yes, I do. So, uh, all right, what do you say to my proposition, then? Take the gem handed down through generations of my family and lend us your ship. I think that's a pretty fair deal, do you not think, Cortez, my old friend? Flavio, already... Already chill. Already comfortable with the situation. Didn't take long. Old friend, your ancestors stole that gem from me, you strutting peacock must be very brave or very, very foolish to ask such a thing of me. I should turn you into a piñata and throw a party on the beach! Hold a friend. Business deals are his bread and butter, you're not wrong. Oh, wait a minute. Don't, uh, do not make me have Mario trounce you again! Well, if I fight you, I will throw this stone into the sea where you will never find it. How would that be? You rattle my bones, Senor Peacock. Very well. I accept your bargain, amigo. Now be very careful with that gem. Ah, check and made, Flavio. I did not make my fortune by failing in negotiation, no. You can talk your way through any deal, I say. Now, you take this. Yeet. Really yeet that. Ha. Ah. Now my precious black skull will sail the seas again. I was getting quite annoyed by the sound of cannons outside anyway. Now I can really stretch my bones and wreak havoc on the seas like in the old days. So Mario, feel free to thank me anytime for saving us all. But for now, we set sail. Yo, do we have enough room for all these damn toads? <clears throat> Just asking for a friend. Or 300. Okay. Just checking. Just checking. We may have done goofed. I feel like after we get off this island, the Mushroom Kingdom's gonna have a serious piracy problem on its hands. Yeah, it's, it's a possibility. <coughs> hey, we're coming too. Let's take them. Come on, all for one, guys. 
Wait, I ain't letting Flavio Fancy Pants hog all the glory. Come on, Captain Stash. That's me. <clears throat> it's been a millennium since I gazed upon the sea. Come to the open waters. Let's do it. Does that ship even have cannons? I don't know. At least we'll get away. Oh, I got ammo to spare. How's that for boom boss boom It has ghosts. Were they eavesdropping the entire time? You fire cannons in here without my permission? You have nerve, mortal. I was gonna ask how we were gonna get out. What the? Crump knows the song. Yo. This is some, uh... Some... Some hella sprite work. Aww. As soon as I take a bite. I was like, oh, the ships are gonna circle each other for a while. I got a minute. Apparently not. Lafayette singing on the way in. Oh, yeah, that's right. Ugh. I'm gonna sink my ratty old ghost ship to the bottom of the ocean. Hear my voice, spirits. Take their ship and show them the meaning of fear. Crump did pay attention. Mario, my captain. It is now your turn again. Get over there and duel that cad. Okay. Yo, we fighting Lord Crumpley. Crumpley! Oh, boo, boo, oh, I'm gonna turn you bad guys into weezies. Oh, wait, that's not right. I'll turn you into seaweed! 50% sea, 50% weed. One percent evil, ninety-nine percent hot gas. And in the meantime, <laughs> Lord Crump, one percent evil, ninety-nine percent hot gas. You got this. Fight how you want to. Oh, I will. Let's find out about Lord Crump. That's Lord Crump, not this guy again. Ugh. Max HP is 30, attack is 3, and defense is 0. He just attacks normally, so don't worry too much about him. But those x not all around him are a force to be reckoned with. They're gonna attack us with all kinds of weird moves. I can just feel it. If we take out their leader, though, they won't be able to focus to attack. Get Crump. Show me to get Crunk. I can do that. Yo, get zippy zapped. BRB? I'll be doing this fight for a minute anyway, so you're good, Diddy. Let's see. How about, uh, how about uh, this sweet feast, eh? Let's try it out. I need some HP anyhow. And FP. Oh, that goes fast. Oh my god, they're big. Oh, boy. Holy crap, 18 and 19? And oh boy! Super version indeed. Oh, I hit the wrong button. That's alright, it worked. Yeah, that's insane. Rooms. I only saw two Mohawk. And I didn't hit either of them. Were there three? I only saw the two. I may have missed one. There were a lot and they were going quick. I did miss all of them. It was super impressive. Yeah, there definitely could have been three. I could have missed the third one. Ho ho ho! You're not gonna set up that easily, losers. Yes, I did narrowly miss the two that I noticed. Nice hat. Thank you very much. I get a lot of compliments on this hat. I am a big fan. Let's see how you like this. x 
was waiting for the oh all come from the uh from the audience I got forked oh it is too okay I feel better then I was like, man, is there a third one that I just completely missed? Alright. Uh. Quick camera, the one that brings them all down? It is. Where did all the forks come from? That's a good question. Yo, get wrecked. Woo! <clears throat> Same, same place the bu buckets and stuff fall from. Yeah, but a bucket I can see in the theater. But giant forks. Just makes me think of the Muppet movie. Turn at the fork in the road. Ah, rude. Oh, man, this is no good. Thought I was almost aced for a second there. But you haven't quite finished me off, you sea urchins. I'm down, but I'm no way out. Oh, boy. Let's see. Alright, Vivian, let's switch you out, Burly. You've done great. Yeah, he's back up to it. Aw, oh, rude. Didn't see that coming. Apparently chapter 5 is the chapter of fake out bosses. Yeah, it's pretty wild, isn't it? Chapter 4 also had two stage boss fights. Yeah, I guess it did. It's just around an hour plus in between stages. Another round? God. Getting zippy zap, see if I care. Swamp. Get DMX knots out of here. Yeah. Allergies getting to you, Talon? It's allergy season in my neck of the woods, and it's uh it's real rough. I often wonder why Mario can't just jump back onto the stage. It's a good question. I do not know. Uh, let's see. Go, Mario! I, know it's been, I, like, I love how it's been five chapters and Crump still does basic frontal somersault attack like he's learned nothing about combat. Why he's capable of learning. True. Well, I guess I could just do a basic jump, and then he'll jump on me. And get zapped. In a minute. 
Okay, I don't know how to avoid that. Maybe he just hasn't gotten a boot upgrade on his adventures. Oh, wait, he landed on poor Yosh. Audience around Daisy passed out. What? <laughs> okay. Well, he does three damage now instead of one, so maybe he has. Oh, uh, rude. That was interesting. I didn't know that would happen. I, I don't want a third boss fight, please. I'm a little bit, um... A little bit, uh, out of energy, shall we say. Man, this is getting old. How can I lose again? I hate losing. Now I gotta think of another excuse for Grotus. Grr, and with that, how I'm gone! One time I used timeout and hit the audience. Oh my god! Yeah, yeah, we whipped him. That loser won't get in our face for a while, for sure! Way to go! Eat seaweed! We did it! Woo! God save! Thank you! I'm Mario Fizz. Hello, I'm Mario Fizz. Oh, good. Skeletor time, baby. You blow it, Lord Cramp. You sicken me. Look, I'm sorry, seriously. We thought, oh, we thought we had the guy cornered, but... The Mario panel is the only one that blinks? Ooh, that's creepy. I'm gonna have to look at that. Stop talking, Lord Cramp. You just stand by until my next order. And, Lord Cramp, think of this as your last chance, understand? Is Luigi coming to do the Teen Girls God voice today? No, no, he's watching. He's watching nephews. So, so he's a bit busy. He came in to bring me pizza, but he's he's watching nephews. Uh, Roger that. Then leave. Hey, you there. What is it, sir? Tell the Shadow Sirens to attack Mario again, and tell them not to fail this time. You got it, sir. Wakanda forever. I have one crystal shard in my hands, and Mario has five. I must take some measures. For a second, I thought the fourth wall was going to get damaged again. When he said, you there. You there, behind the screen, holding the controller. Oh, Tech called me in here again. I wonder what it is this time. They will fall. They've fallen already. Yes, Tech? Tech? Was that noise you? What's wrong? Yo, everybody get your, get your drinkies ready. It's time for some thirst. Cheers, Mohawk. Tech's having a crisis. <clears throat> I must request that you do something a bit more dangerous this time. Dangerous? I would like you to sneak into Sir Grotus's room and look for a data disk. A data disk? Why do you need that? Although I can view data on the network. <laughs> oh, magic gosh. Is Tech thirsty tonight? Come on, you know he is. It's better if you don't know. Ooh, I'm gonna take that as a yes. Yo, get that Luina sippy sip. I am unable to access the data of computers that are not linked to the network. Sir Grotus has information that I even I am unable to view. But I must know it. I must know that information. Grotus knows about network security, apparently. Well, then he's better than most supervillains, now, isn't he? But how will I get in there? Will I be disguised again? Not this time. No one other than Sir Grotus can enter his room. When Sir Grotus is elsewhere, there are guards outside that permit no entry. But there is a way. You will be fine if you act according to my instructions. What is he hiding? It's a good question. I must tell you, I do not want to make you do such a dangerous thing. But now I have no one to ask, to ask but you. I don't mind tech, really. Ask me anything. AMA. I got a new movie coming out. 
Anyway, let's get back to Rampart. <laughs> Most super villains do know about network security. They just don't care about being hacked because they're too brilliant. Oh, so they're on Max. Max don't get viruses. He's hiding the ultimate hot dog spice. Well then, first leave the room and take the elevator up as you did earlier. Dookie. Oh, little footsteps. I love them. I forgot about them. Hello. They're all like Dr. Claw. Beyond brilliant. Just really bad at being a bad guy. Truth. You will first go in the opposite direction of Sir Rodas's room. Exit the elevator and enter the room with a green lamp lit above it. This is pretty cute music. Oh, not that way. Well, let me look! There are guards in that room, Princess Peach. Please head in the opposite direction. Head for the room with the green lamp. I can't tell what direction's which. You gotta let me look. Remember, the, ramp, the lamp is rectangular. I know what they mean by lamp this time. It's all good. By lamp, they just mean light. Ooh, potion. Now I will have- Oh my god, we are getting a potion. Now I will have you concoct a potion that will make you transparent. You mean a potion that makes me invisible? Yes, you will enter Sir Grotus' room by becoming completely invisible. I'm invisible! Can you see me? Yes. <sighs> Time to bake a cake! No, I meant a globe. Wow, okay. How do we make it? We're quenching actual thirst today. You must first set all the potions on the desk in the concoctionator. It's a machine in the back, but even I don't know which potion to set where. There should be memos left in this room by the x not researchers. Please use them as references and set the potions in the machine. Okay. Note, place the orange potion between the blue potion and the green potion. I'm gonna need to get a piece of paper out. Let's, let's be honest. Um, let me find one. That's not what I want here. God, any food sounds good? Behold, Perry the Platypus, the concoctionator! Teddy, you gonna get some food? When, uh... When this is done? Blue, orange, green. Okay. Another note, please. Hello? Note? Note! Place two potions between the green and the red potion. Potions between the green and the red. Oh, well, I could do that. That would work. I had shake and bake chicken nuggets and Velveeta for dinner tonight. Ooh, boy. Any other notes? No, do not place the red potion on the far right. I will not. Note, place the blue potion next to the red potion. Okay, I've got that. Thank you. Oh, then I have it. I only needed two of those notes, honestly. Unfortunately, the Velveeta didn't maintain its flavor well when the chick Excuse me, got dunked in it. Aw, that's disappointing. We tried giving Flynn Dino Nuggies today. Ooh, how did he like him? Alright, so we're gonna go red. A blue, a l'orange, a veiled. He mostly ate the breading. I don't think he's quite ready for the chicken yet. Aw. I ate rice and chicken for dinner. Very nice. Um, we were, I was real busy before stream. Maybe a little too hard to chew still. Chop them up real tiny, maybe. Um, I had a couple of little zucchini muffins from the freezer. And... The leftovers of what we fed the boys tonight. So there was a little bit of mac and cheese and corn. And then Luigi brought me this pizza. Alright. Very well. 
then please cue the button on the control panel on the left side of the room. Hi, chef. Either some Lunchables or ramen? Ramen sounds good. Please press the button where the beaker stops to dispense each potion. Pink? It's not what color it would be, but all right. Uh, hello? Oh, they're trying to trick me. I missed! I will heat the mixed potion in the beaker for 30 seconds. What kind of Lunchables? The pizza kind? Don't forget the ketchup. Tell it's not a it's not a spaghetti lunchable. Press the button exactly 30 seconds after heating stop starts to stop the machine. Okay. Not sure when that started. Second, just to be sure. Hopefully that was close. Ketchup is gross and you cannot change my mind. Just simple ham and cheese. By my calculations, it should be finished. But did it come out correctly, do you think? Guess we'll find out. Very good. Then please drink it, all of it, if you please. What? Drink this? Is it safe? It smells really funky. Please, you must drink it. Okay. You have done it. You have successfully made yourself transparent. Congratulations. I can still see all my clothes, though. Don't tell me I gotta get naked. This boy just wants me to get naked. But I must ask you to take off your dress, however. Even the potion can make cannot make the dress invisible. What? That's indecent. No way. Oh. It does look like it does look like my head turned into a bigger doge. Okay, fine, I guess. If it's the only way. Not just your dress, but also your gloves and your earrings and your crown. Yeah, I know. I thought the same thing, Doge. I was like, oh no, her head's gone! When you enter Sir Grotus's room, first locate the disc with the recorded data. I was laughing so hard there for a minute. Oh, it's going there. Yeah, it is, Kirby. Then insert the disc into the personal computer and connect it to the network. When you are finished with that, please come back to this room. I will teach you how to make yourself normal again. Gee, this is kind of a complicated plan, isn't it? I suppose. Now, please go to Sir Grotus's room. Okay, this potion better not wear off when I'm out in the open. What? Well, that was creepy. Why the door opened by itself, even when there was no one there? Malfunction? Or am I just totally losing it? That one. Doop, 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 walking along. Doing a thing. I was just gonna ask how long it'll last. <clears throat> no one'll worry. No one'll. No one'll notice. Okay. So assuming the data disk is over in this room. But oh, look at all the chops. This must be Grotus's room. Now, where's that disc? I see some discs hey, over guys. here. Super Kirby, thank you for the follow, my friend. I appreciate you. Welcome to the Spud Squad. Oh, found it. This must be it. I got a data disc. Let's be real. I'm pretty sure in the era of the GameCube, we were not using floppies anymore. I'm, I might be 
be misremembering my history, but I don't think so. Um, well, yeah. Now I insert the disk into the computer and connect to the network. First, I gotta wait for the dial up to load. Ooh. Nice song. I did it! Yes, I did it! It's working! I did some technology! Now we'll wait, I guess. God, these fish are making me happy. They're adorable. Looks like it's all done. I better put the disc back where I got it. No, I want to keep it. There. Like I was never here. Get out of here. Boogie on out of here before the... Before the potion wears off and I'm just naked. Some sound effects going on. The NES startup screen, right? It's great. Hey, we made it back. Thank you, Princess Peach. I was able to obtain the data I desired. Startup. The NES didn't have a startup screen. Is that right? Well, I'm glad. Now I will teach you how to become visible again. It is quite simple, actually. Merely drink the green potion. You will revert to normal instantaneously. Okay, just hang on one minute. I gotta put my clothes on first! Smart, Peach. Smart to remember this. Okay, now I'm ready. Let's see here, the green potion, right? This green potion? Or just this green potion? Oh, what a relief! I was kinda worried I might never be visible again. There was never any danger of that. Now please, re return to the computer room. Damn it, she remembered. Always oh, for the Famicom disk system. Well, that makes sense with the disks then. Not a thing I knew. Say, by the way, Tech, what was that data? I am still analyzing it. The data is very heavily encrypted. But if my prediction is correct. If it's correct, what? No, I cannot afford any mistakes or assumptions. I will let you know when my analysis is complete. Now, please use the communicator if you wish. Okay, you'll tell me when you decipher the data, huh? Good, then I'll use the communicator, thanks! I've written my message, would you send it? Madala! The message has been sent. We are done now. Please go back to the room. Okay, take care, Tech. Bye! Creepy, thirsty computer. Thank you, Princess Peach. Why, you're welcome, Tech. Princess Peach, I will protect you. Ooh, it's creepy, boy. Tech boy, creepy. Do not like. Alright, guys. It's that time. We'll probably start seeing... Yeah, she's not blinking, is she? The next uh, bit, but... That's gonna be it for me. Oh, is Bowser here? Bowser's here. We'll have to catch up with Bowser next time, though. <laughs> We're gonna leave on this hecka intense music. I love it. That's hilarious. Oh, good. It's not completely intense the entire time. All right, guys. That is it for me tonight. We will have to find out about Bowser next week. Um, whew. That was fun. That was adorable. I love this game so much. It's so great. We have a good time. Thank you all so much for being with here with me tonight. Thank you all, guys, for the follows. And for just hanging with me and being wonderful. You guys make it for me. Honestly. 
Uh, we'll be back with this next week, of course. Uh, my new friends, I stream at 7.30 p.m. Eastern Time. Um, if you check the schedule on Twitch, it'll give you... I think it'll give it to you in your local time, if necessary. Um, but my next stream will be Wednesday, uh, 7.30 p.m. Eastern Time. We're playing Ace Attorney! We're on the third game, Trials and Tribulations. And it's... or Justice for All? Now I forget which one. We're on the third game, and it's very, very fun. So I hope to see you guys again. If not then, next week for more Paper Mario. I'm gonna go finish my have a great night, everybody. Take care of yourselves, and I'll see you next time. Bye.